Few cases are as mystifying as the disappearance of Russell Hill and Carol Clay in remote Victorian bushland. Here we have two people that have literally vanished into the wilderness. Certainly in a Victorian context, and I think, you know, even nationally, it, uh, it, it's quite a unique investigation. But it's the dense, isolated Wanangatta Valley, where police believe the pair's bodies still lie, that may unlock the mystery, especially with tourists set to venture in as restrictions lift. So any clothing that people might find in an unusual location would be of interest to us. Just any personal items that people may find in strange locations, give us a call on uh, Crime Stop and let us know. Russell Hill and Carol Clay were longtime family friends who in March last year vanished from their campsite. It was later found scorched, a drone missing, but precious few other clues, leaving behind families with the agony of not knowing. Sometimes I see someone walking down the street and I think it looks a bit like him. I mean, just that little glimmer of hope that it could be him. But I really know it won't be because I... I really don't think that he, if he was alive, he would not contact not us. Police are narrowing their theories, but believe a third party of one or more people was involved during or after a violent act. We're not tied to uh, um, one or two people or even more, and of course, you know, that involvement could be not involved in the actual event that happened up there, but could be involved after the fact in terms of a concealment or assistance. The families are speaking publicly for the first time, hoping to flush out those hiding the truth. My message to them is that you've undertaken a heinous act and you've got to live with that for the rest of your life and it's time to turn yourself in. We just need closure. And police say they're confident a breakthrough is coming. Mary Guerin, ABC News.